uh, I think we don't know much but uh, about the Gandhi's philosophy. Gandhi's philosophy was totally different what today's politicians are doing in the politics. Gandhi's thought about politics is it is a way by which one can eliminate the negative elements of the society. And today's politics is all, is all about just using them. The Talks Club. Keep talking, keep learning. A 24-year-old young uh, lawyer who just landed uh, Durban, uh, South Africa, as uh, he as he got a as as he got a legal contract of one year with an Indian uh, with an Indian merchant in Durban. So from Durban, he continued his journey uh, by taking an first-class uh, uh, train ticket. Uh, and on that same compartment, there was an Englishman who somehow uh, make him out of that compartment by saying that dogs and Indians are not allowed in this compartment. So it was totally uh, uh, a, a big thing for him. So uh, so anyhow, he completed his journey uh, in that uh, luggage compartment, in that cold shipping night. So after reaching to his destination, uh, he tried to get a room at, uh, to stay at night. Uh, but uh, he was too much uh, uh, shocking by seeing that wherever he used to go, he find that either uh, many of them used to tell that the room is uh, the room is uh, full, or they or they just used, or they just used to say that uh, we don't give rooms to Indians. So it was too much uh, humiliating for him. But anyhow, after leaving and after talking with their local peasants, uh, uh, the local workers who used to work in farmers, and the slaves, which were usually brought up by the uh, from the English, uh, uh, sorry, from the India, uh, from the Englishmen, they are living in a very harsh condition. They, uh, the laws which were provided by him uh, by the Englishmen were too much uh, against them. They used to discriminate on the basis of their uh, on the basis of their origin and on the basis of their skin color. So uh, what he thought is that is uh, there is something to change here. So what he did, he first started uh, he first started to uh, giving uh, teaching to the that small uh, peasants uh, to uh, English teaching so that at least they can present their thoughts, their expressions to the local uh, to the local. Uh, legal offices, uh, and and in between this, uh, that one year contract was going to over, and at the day before coming back to India, what he did, he just shooted a file against the Englishman, so that uh, the peasants can get their uh, uh, importance in that place. So by uh, knowing this, uh, uh, by by knowing this shooted, uh, what uh, he uh, what the peasants did, they tried to make him uh, stay for one more for for one more month, so that at least uh, he uh, he can help him out in that court. Uh, court uh, practice. So at that time, the, he, the man, the Gandhiji uh, was uh, 25 years of age and before coming uh, from the South Africa, he was 45 years of age. Now that one month converted into 20 years. What For what? Just to make peasants uh, to get their legal, uh, to get their legal things, just to get the basic, uh, basic human, uh, human things like uh, they should, they, that they should not be discriminated on the basis of their customs, their religions, uh, their, uh, their thought process their skin color so all of this uh, so uh, in between these 20 years what he did he did satyagraha he did non violence he did a salt march like that uh, what he did in india uh, so in india which is famously known as the great uh, the great uh, uh, the great march in which in which uh, 17 satyagras including his wife kasturva walked around 60 miles just to protest the, these uh, illegal things so once uh, his mentor uh, which uh, his political mentor Gopal Krishna Gokhale once told that the uh, the becoming of Mahatma from the Gandhi is initiated from South Africa and which make us to the uh, which make India to the to a free uh, free country. So after knowing all these in, uh, incidents, what if Gandhi were with us today? What uh, to uh, to whom uh, he would have uh, supported to the politics to the Indian National Congress to the BJP or to any other political uh, party? So what I think is that by seeing today's scenario, what Gandhi will what Gandhi will do that first he will boycott the election, he will boycott, and after that what he will do, he will try to make aware the youths, he will try to make aware the youths, and he will tell the basic uh, the basic infrastructure, the basic things what a democracy should need, uh, and then uh, I think we don't know much but uh, about the Gandhi's philosophy. Gandhi's philosophy was totally different what today's politicians are doing in the politics. Gandhi's thought about politics is it is a way by which one can eliminate the negative elements of the society. And today's politics is all, is all about just using them. So uh, if uh, what I think is that if Gandhi got a chance to vote right now, he, 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 uh, he suddenly voted Nota. 
and what i did in my first election so thank you